As Spitza, Spitza back, along with Edler. And up front, Bo Horvat. They lose the draw of the Penguins to Malkin. The shot, he scores! Evgeny Malkin with a rocket. Makes the Penguins get right back into this thing, and they still have a lot of time left on the second power play. Spitza can't get it out on his backhand. Not sure why he tried the backhand maneuver instead of the forehand, but four seconds after that turnover by Spisa, the Penguins and Malkin, look at that platter. That pass was right on the platter to Malkin, and he beat Ryan Miller to the short side, and the Penguins have made it two to one, still on this power play for another minute 50. Now up the right wing, it's Carl Hagelin. Hagelin to Malkin, Malkin to the slot. And he can't pull the trigger. He throws it in front and it goes in. It goes in off a Canucks stick. I think Lyndon Bay put it in his own net. Penguins get a balance. It's a good back check here. Edom takes the stick away from Malkin, who stays with it, puts it to the front of the net, and Bay puts it in his own net. And he just shuffled it there. <laughs> that was a r ridiculous for Bay to make that play. But puck luck available. Canucks read that, and Emerson Edom goes the other way. Daly steps up to poke it away from him. Now Kessel will pick it up. Kessel to Malkin cutting in. Malkin with a shot. Score! The hat trick for Gino! And Evgeny Malkin on the power play on a five on three, took the Latang shot. That was his first. Vey put one in for Malkin. That was his second. And here Evgeny Malkin after the bad change, rockets it by the glove hand of Miller, and we're tied at three.